All right, greetings. Happy Thanksgiving. That's what day this is. Thanksgiving in America, and I'm very thankful to be saved. I'm very thankful that the Holy Ghost has filled me, baptized me. I'm thankful that Jesus Christ is my Savior, and I thank you that I can. I'm thankful that I can call God my Father. And I'm thankful that you're even watching this video. Anyways, we're out preaching today. I wasn't sure what I was going to be doing today. So I put on my calendar, it's up to the Holy Ghost to lead me. And last night I was firmly confirmed uh, that uh, I would be preaching today. So I got here about five minutes to 12. It's about 10 after now. I'm kind of standing in the sun today because it is cold. That wind is icy here in Boulder. And uh, so where we're at today, this is Highway 28. Uh, Highway 28, I don't know why I keep saying that. Uh, this is 28th Street, Highway 36. Goes out of Denver all the way up to uh, Lyons up in the north. And this highway behind me here, that's uh, 119. It goes out of Longmont. It goes up farther out, Colorado. Colorado. It goes up to uh, Nederland also, <laughs> which I was on last Friday. Tomorrow is the fourth Friday of the month, and I'll be in uh, Longmont. Longmont, Colorado. It's about an hour ride on the bus. I take the bus everywhere I go where I walk. This is a 40-minute walk to where I'm at today. Worked up quite a sweat. But I had to have all these clothes on so I'd stay warm. So it gets to be a challenge in the wintertime, but, you know, such as life on the street. But I am so thrilled that I can be here I just finished my part of my prayer that I start the ministry off with. Had a lot of people looking at me going, what is he doing? It's Thanksgiving. That's what it looked like on their face. But uh, you know, you have to do what the Holy Ghost tells you to do. And uh, being 67, starting my 68th year, man, you know, all I want to do is serve the Lord. I mean, I don't need to sit in somebody's house and I don't need to sit in a restaurant. I don't need to hide at my home because I'm, you know, by myself been single for 25 years, 26 years, something like that, 27 years, that's, that's growing. And I don't need to sit and, uh, you know, I don't need to do nothing. I need to come out and preach. I need to minister. I need to be a witness for Jesus Christ. The angels of God aren't taking the day off. Jesus isn't taking the day off. And God's not taking the day off. The Holy Ghost is not taking the day off. The Holy Ghost is at work saving people, witnessing, confirming the preaching of the gospel with signs following. God bless you, man. <laughs> so as I stand out here, I'm actually encouraging all the believers who come by and honk or wave or give me a thumbs up or smile at me, whatever they do, however they do it. And this wind. It's, it's tough when you got a four-foot banner, 10 feet tall. But I have my uh, Bible with me, too, so I'll... If it gets too windy, I can just lay the banner down and lift up the Bible and keep on ministering. Right behind me is the Flatiron Mounds back there. That's hard to see. But I hope you're having a good day. I'm having a great day serving the Lord Jesus Christ. My hope is to serve the Lord every day of my life except the Sabbath. That is one day I have to keep holy unto the Lord. That's Saturday, not a Sunday. That is, uh, God bless you over there. <laughs> All the way across this huge intersection. <laughs> Waving their horns and stuff. <laughs> God bless you. <laughs> oh, we got a horn fest going on here with everybody honking the horns. Praise God though, I'm out here witnessing and preaching the gospel being a witness, being available to whoever needs something. Last night when I was praying for this corner, I uh, kept seeing people who might be alone, who may be thinking about committing suicide today. And I thought if I can be out here, if I can be out here and witness and be available to, to, to God that he can use me today, you know, maybe I can save one more soul, you know. I praise God that God uses me, man. I praise God He uses me, and I hope He uses you too. And if you don't know Jesus Christ as your Savior, if you don't know Jesus Christ, you can just do what I did 47 years ago. I just said, Jesus, if you're real, here I am. That was the cry of my heart. And He saved me and set me free, called me into His service. 
I've been serving them all these years. And I am so on fire for God, I can hardly stand it. And I'm so thrilled and so thankful to be serving Him. With all my heart, with all my soul, with all my strength. In Jesus' name. Thank you for your prayers, man. God bless you all. God bless you. Bye-bye. I love you. I love you so much.